New developments involving Osama bin Laden's son believed to be killed in a takedown. U.S. officials saying he was being groomed to lead Al Qaeda. Our foreign correspondent James Longman has the latest on this. Good morning, James. Good morning, Cecilia. Osama bin Laden was perhaps the world's most infamous terrorist, and now we know his son and apparent heir is also dead. Two U.S. officials tell ABC News that Hamza bin Laden, who was believed to be about 30 years old, was killed at some point over the last two years, and that U.S. intelligence played a role in the operation. But it remains unclear where or how he died. Now, back in February, the State Department offered a $1 million reward for his capture, calling him a key leader. And his last public statements came just last year when he threatened his native Saudi Arabia with violent jihad. Papers found in the Abbottabad compound where his father was killed in the U.S. raid in 2011 show he may have been groomed for a prominent role in al-Qaeda. Cecilia? Yeah, James, he's really being, as you say, uh, labeled as a key leader, but do you have a sense of how significant this takedown really was? Well, certainly on a symbolic level, Cecilia, the Bin Laden name is a powerful recruiting tool for al-Qaeda. But they've been losing ground to groups like ISIS for some time. So arguably, I guess they represent a greater threat now. Okay, Cecilia. James Longman, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.